Now would I be as God created me. Lesson 237 of A Course in Miracles. We're in the workbook section. And this is A Course in Miracles with a whole Ponopono lens. Today, I will accept the truth about myself. I will arise in glory and allow the light in me to shine upon the world throughout the day. I bring the world the tidings of salvation which I hear as God my Father speaks to me, and I behold the world that Christ would have me see, aware it ends the bitter dream of death, aware it is my Father's call to me. Christ is my eyes today, and he the ears that listen to the voice for God today. Father, I come to you through him who is your son and my true self with a capital S as well. Amen. And so throughout the day, as I am reminded, I like to do Ho'oponopono, and that is how I get to listen to the voice for God. Sometimes I sit in stillness and silence, but that is few and far between because I usually tend to be busy. Uh, but I'm going to try to incorporate more stillness and meditation. But in the meantime, I do Ho'oponopono, and that's when I say to divinity, I'm sorry, please forgive me, I love you, thank you. I repeat that on a loop for any triggering situations or just in general or for upcoming events. Sometimes I say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, repeating it on a loop internally to divinity or I love you, I love you, I love you. And so when I do these things, you know, when I do Ho'oponopono, I get different impressions or I feel the peace of God, especially when I am triggered and uh, divinity reminds me of different words, different scriptures and things like that. There is a prayer. Let me see if I can access it for you and I'll put it in the comments. I love this prayer. It's from Nook Sanchez. Holy Spirit, please help me to forgive myself for having unknowingly used, and then you fill in the blank. It could be a person, pain, sickness, lack, anxiety, self-judgment, anger, etc. So for havingly, for having unknowingly used whatever to attack myself and to separate from your love as my holy self with a capital S. Amen. And so uh, when I say that prayer, it's a felt experience and I feel peace as I release the situation. And so hopefully that prayer will help you. Uh, let me know in the comments if you have any questions or comments and I'll be happy to answer your questions and reply back to your comments. I hope you're having a wonderful day or evening wherever you're at in the world. Talk to you later. Bye.